Hi Taurus, I'm back guys. How are you? I hope everything is going well with you guys. I know, I'm back again. I had to do you guys this video over. Didn't have any sound. I don't know what's going on. All that, yeah. But we're going to have to start over. Hope you guys aren't too bad, but yeah. Alright, so if you're new to my channel, go ahead and click the bell to subscribe. You don't want to miss out. Go ahead and smash that like button, okay? So, let's see what energy we have coming towards my Taurus. I need an overall energy for Taurus, Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. If you have Taurus in those placements, you can apply this video. All right, we got the Four of Swords, all right? Four of Swords. Ooh, okay, Four of Swords. Some of you guys may feel like you need to take a break or you are on a break. Um, maybe you're thinking about something here. Something's on your mind. Let's see. <laughs> yeah, some of you guys are tired, okay? You're done with something. Ten of Wands. Yeah, something is completed, okay? Um, you're feeling like a cycle has completed itself, all right? Yeah, you feel like you're, you're, you're tired of something. Something. Something, something here. Uh, yeah, look at this. The death card. Mm. Okay. The death card and the four of swords. I don't like that energy together. Um, something's making you worry. Okay, something's making you worry. Well, I gotta get go into this because I don't really like this combination together. All right, so let's see. All right, so page of wands, okay. So you're tired of asking for something, it looks like, okay? <laughs> Past energy is the five of cups and the hermit card. Look at these two cards. Like, they're both facing the same way. Like, they both have their heads down in shame and regret here with the five of cups. The hermit card, this is the card of Virgo, so you could be dealing with the Virgo. But something here is just like, um, I'm getting like someone's holding their head down in shame or regret here. Let me see what the future energy is. you guys' cards because they're like flying all over the place and I want to see what this is before I even get into it. I feel like some of you guys may be tired of hearing about something or tired of asking something or someone asking you. You feel burdened by this situation and you want something to stop. Okay, so give me that outcome. All right, Six of Swords. It was actually in the reverse. Yeah, it's like, get over it. That's what I'm getting. Like, it's over with. It's done. It's done. Get over it. That's what I'm getting. Okay, why is the death card here? The Sun and the Page of Swords. So, there's definitely like some news here. There's some news. Why is the Four of Swords here? Maybe some of you guys are watching the news. Four of Wands. Okay. 
okay some of you may be thinking about a new home as well queen of pentacles you guys is here um seven of swords is here so someone maybe you feel like someone is has lied to you or is lying about something why was the page of wands here Ten of Swords, okay. Hmm. It's like stop talking about or stop asking. You stop asking about something. Ten of Wands. Three of Swords. Something is sad, okay? Okay, so you don't want to talk about something anymore because it's sad. Is what I'm getting here. It's a touchy subject, okay? For some of you, it could involve, like, a death. Um, because I, I I got the Ten of Swords, the Death card, as well as the Four of Swords. And, like, that could be, like, a physical death, okay? Um, the situation is extremely sad. It's something that you could um, have is watching on the news or it's just trending, Okay, because with that page of swords and the sun card is definitely something that you saw or you heard about. Okay. I'm just getting like feel bad. A guilty conscience is what I'm getting here as well. It's something about back to back, okay? Two of Pentacles and a Chariot Reverse. The World and the Five of Pentacles. Something that's outside. This is something that happened in the past. And I'm, I'm getting like you guys are grieving something here that is extremely sad, okay? It's extremely sad. And I'm getting um, as well like God energy. Because I got the judgment card and the emperor. This just kind of make, makes me feel about God. Okay. Like the way you're viewing it. This is about your view on something. Why is the six of pentacles here? I'm getting like only God can judge me or God can judge them. Somebody's talking about it at work with the page of pentacles and the three of pentacles. So maybe you're having a conversation with, you know, your peers. Why is the six of pentacles here? Yeah, you keep hearing about it everywhere you go. That's what I'm, Spirit just put that on me too. Like you keep hearing about it. This is past energy. Like you keep hearing about it. People keep talking about it, bringing it, bringing it up. Why is the Six of Pentacles here? Okay. Something about God to give you strength is what I'm definitely seeing here. There's a lot of confusion. Like, it's a lot of chaos. We got the Five of Swords and the Seven of Cups. That's definitely more, a, a lot of confusion. Like, there's a lot of chaos. Maybe something that I feel like some of you guys are, like, either watching the news or you're hearing all of this. You're hearing all of this. And I'm getting God will give you the strength is what I'm hearing as well. All right, so Queen of Wands in the reverse. I got the Queen of Wands in reverse. I got the Queen of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, King of Swords here at the bottom of it. Okay. This is pissing you off. This is pissing you off. And you're tired of hearing about it. You're tired of seeing it. Why the Queen of Swords here? Okay. The Justice card. Some of you could be dealing with the Libra. But it's like a constant reminder here with the Six of Cups. Like it's like you, it keeps being brought up. Um, you may not, you may not be saying much about it, but you're listening in on it. And I feel like the way a lot of you may be viewing this is that you know you're gonna have to put this in God's hands. That's what I'm getting to. Give it to God. Is what I'm hearing. I definitely see that. Six of Pentacles. Uh, Emperor and the Judgment card. I'm getting like that's what I'm getting like. 
give it to God. Why is the, uh, yeah, Nine of Wands and the Devil card here. So others are viewing it like some are like on guard, like looking for the bad guys is what I'm getting here. And this could be about protesting. Okay, so this could you I feel like you guys are watching or keeping an eye on the news or you know, people are constantly talking about this situation. Okay, why is the two of cups here? Okay. Alright. So you in the hopes and fears we got the two of cups and the fool. So maybe you're hoping that there could be some type of coming together, uniting here with the two of cups. Why is the six of swords in the reverse? Okay, nine of pentacles and the lover's card and a page of cups. So something, it's like you're not over, you're not over this situation or the situation has, it's still here. It hasn't moved on um, coming into the near future. It's still something that's happening. Um, and I feel like for some of you guys, there could be like a Gemini involved that you're talking to, but I'm getting like there's a conversation about being independent or doing something on your own. Why is the nine of pentacles here? Being self-sufficient. Being self-sufficient. Telling your loved ones to prepare or be um, to be uh, secure with this nine of pentacles. Especially here with this star card. They're still like having hope for this situation. But I, I don't see in the near future where this is going to be a move. You're moved on or, or the situation has completed. Okay. So let's get a deeper look. Let's see what advice and guidance we have. break the chain see i'm feeling like um and then we have unbound we got unbound at the bottom of the deck so releasing soul patterns contracts and past lives i feel like there is a breaking of a, a cycle here we gotta break the chain ancestral patterns healing and rewriting the future okay this came out twice i think this came out for leo it's for leo's reading as well but there's something here about breaking the cycle um, the, things are changing. Things are changing, okay? Patterns are being broken. Chains are being broken. We got star mother. How can you mother yourself? How can you mother yourself? So some of you guys need nurturing, caring, um, or some of you are trying to carry that, that motherly type energy. Or some of you guys just need to, like, you know, go within yourselves. We got leap. <laughs> some of you have been, have been you know, sitting back. Because I got somebody here taking a break. Sisterhood of the Rose. So some of you guys may have just, like, been chilling out lately. But it's time to take some type of action because we got leap. You go first and the universe is going to catch you. So there's there's a, some type of action that needs to be taken. Because I feel like there's some cycles that are being broken, some chains that are being broken. Um, things are changing. And like I said, uh, some of you may have been seeing the number 555. I know I have. I've been seeing it like crazy. But things are changing. And patterns and old ways of doing things, viewing things, are shifting. Things are shifting. Let's see what um, messages the angels have. What message do you have for Taurus? Get more information. You guys need some more information on something. 
And I feel like we got don't stop here. And we have ads for help from others. So I feel like some of you don't want to ask for help because I got no here at the bottom of the day. So I feel like some of you guys don't have all the information on a subject or something. So you need to get more involved so you can get get all of the information that you need on the subject. We got don't stop and ask for help from others. Why is get more information here? Yeah, pay the swords. See, see, some of you guys may feel like you don't know all the details. Because I got the Queen of Pentacles here. And it's about what happened here with the King of Wands, possibly to a fire sign male, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Yeah, to make an assumption. Okay, so maybe you feel like all the details isn't out on the situation. And before you... Um, before you get uh, emotionally attached to the situation, you need to get more of the details. So, pay the swords is you digging and prying for that information. Yep. Yeah, two of swords and the world. Okay, so you don't have all the details. You're trying to get all the details. Okay. So, don't stop. Let's see. Justice. Yeah, justice isn't served on a certain on a certain situation. And if something is extremely heartbreaking and you can you have condolences for the family. You got the four of wands, the ace of cups, the ten of wands, and the three of swords. All of this is saying having um being emotionally well feeling sad, having, you know, that's the emotion that you feel for the community or the the city, whatever this is, because I got the four of wands here. So this is telling me that it's about a group of individuals. I mean, your heart goes out and I feel like you don't, just don't have all the details to a situation or a story. I do see that maybe some of you guys are only getting information from the internet with the page of swords and the world here. That's definitely internet. So maybe you don't want to listen like to everything that comes out on the internet because you know there are fake stories. Things of that nature. So you just feel like maybe you need you need more details. You're trying to get more details to the story. Something here about this about this uh, situation means it's, it's calling for justice. The justice card came out. Okay, so why is the justice card here? We got the emperor. This could be a physical judge, okay? This could be a judge or a person of authority. I'm getting like a police officer, uh, especially with the justice and the emperor card together. Definitely polices. <laughs> I don't know. If, yeah, police. <laughs> police men, police women. Okay, I feel like there's lots of confusion here. Definitely. For some of you guys, I'm getting that you're possibly keeping your eye on the news on the protesting and things of that nature. All right, so ask for help from others. Knight of Swords. I'm getting younger information. I mean, younger, um, the younger generation with the Knight of Swords. This is very young, but um, young energy, but uh, flighty more upbeat i'm getting like the younger community okay because we even got the knight of pentacles here these both of these energies are very young like energy okay why is the knight of swords yeah okay i'm getting like love <laughs> i i really am getting black lives matter here I got the Knight of Swords, the Devil, and the Lovers. I'm definitely getting Black Lives Matter. Okay. And we love our black sons. I'm, I'm getting all of that from this reading. Okay. I'm definitely getting that. Definitely getting that. 
So maybe you're trying to help spread the word, okay? So you've been get so you've been researching is what I'm getting. You've been researching. And I and I, when I first put the cards, I didn't want to say a death, but I I saw that when it first came out, but I was definitely not trying to immediately put that out but until I got clarifiers, but I'm definitely getting and I'm going to I'm going to share post this as Black Lives Matter. Okay? Because as many of you guys know, I'm from Brunswick, Georgia, and I've been posting in my community tab about the Maude Arbery story, okay? So, this reading here is, is hitting a little different. This reading is hit, really hitting different, okay? So, this, the title of this reading is going to be Black Lives Matter. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below, all right? Let me know how you guys feel. Don't forget to share this reading. If you want to book your very own personal reading, the information is going to be in the comment section. I'm sorry, in the description box. All right. So I'll talk to you guys later.